Hi guys, today we are going to see uh, latching relays, latching relays operation and connections of latching relay. So connection diagram of latching relay. So see here, the latching relays top view should be in mentioned in top and then latching relays simple connection should be made for the downside. The first one is the top view of latching relay. So see here, this is a latching relay for the model of uh, Hager and Snyder is the same like that. So the first two terminals for the auxiliary supply and then second turn two terminals the one and two and three and four. The one and two for the first two terminals and three and four the second two terminals and one and three for the normally open and two and four the normally close. That means the thing should be shifted for the one is operated and second one is not operated and then second one is operated and first one is operated so this is the thing should be operating for the one by one first one is operated and second one is out not operated this should be the latching relay function that means if you based on any message you are giving to latching relay the latching relay is going to ship the things that means the duty sharing you that means the not duty sharing that is shifting the based on the message if you take the pressure message that means the pressure you going to shed the first one is the low pressure and then second one is the high pressure that means the high pressure machine and low pressure machine if you need to operate the low pressure machine you going to connect for the 1 and 3 and then 2 and 4 as the high pressure machine operation that means the first time you are going to switch on the latching relay the low pressure machine going to switch on the based on the your message if you giving the another message the that means high the relay should be operated that is shifting the next one that means the off and going to on that means the latching relay going to off totally and then switch on the second one that means the low to high pressure so this is a shifting will be available for the latching relay so actually i have said for example for pressure not for the pressure there is a lot of things are there available so here i showed the uh, example connection so this 230 voltage accelerator supply and then the K1, K2 for the connectors are available here. The L1, L2 for the latching relays terminals. So here 1 and 2, uh, sorry 1 and 3 and 2 and 4 terminals should be available here. So the here I am going to give you supply here. The first one should be operated for the at the time of low pressure. The second one should be operated for at the time of high pressure. This is should be automatically shifting by using the latching relay. So that's why we use for the latching relay. Now I am going to show the how to we operate that by using the DOL starter through latching relay operation of the uh, two machines so see here the dual starter should be mirrored here the stop and start push buttons so we can connect further directly to the k1 connectors so this is the same thing we need to repeat for the k2 also that means the second part the same same connection should be we need to repeat for the second part also so there is a no space that's why i didn't make here so the start push button you are going to push and the k1 should be guard the supply and then the motor first one is going to run that is the thing manual and auto operation this is the way of we easily run the motor by using latching relay and then don't forget to subscribe my channel and if you have any doubt please comment here thank you for watching